everyone welcome back to the channel or welcome to the channel today's video is all about what i think is the best budget hard tanu cover for the third and fourth gen toyota tacoma so let's get into it first off if you're new to the channel here this is my brand new 2024 toyota tacoma trd off-road this is known as the fourth generation tacoma this bed cover was actually made for the third gens but it also uh, fits the fourth gens. It's a little dusty because I'm out here just kind of putting around on their dirt roads, but this is made out of 14 millimeter aluminum panels and frames. So 14 millimeters is like just over a half inch, I believe. So um, it's very sturdy. It has this uh, really cool texture that I think actually kind of matches the texture on the truck here. This is made by Most Plus. And I'll put a link down in the description if you're interested in getting one of these. So let me go over a few of the features on top here. This could hold up to 300 pounds. I stood on it. No issues whatsoever. We open up the tailgate. Really nice feature is that it has LED lights on both sides here, which is really cool. So if you're needing to grab something out of the back of your truck, it's dark you have LED lights uh, in the back here, which makes it really awesome. And in the back here, there's these quick release latches. And then it easily folds over. And these, these will tuck in right here. And then it folds up and then it has these Little clips right here keep it from blowing in the wind. So you have that tied down. If you have something that's gonna be a little bit taller, you can put it in here and have this open. So that way you don't have to take it all the way off, which is nice. Another feature is that it has this rubber lining right here, which makes it waterproof. Now I did go to the car wash and I hosed it down because I was curious to see just how good it really was at uh, being waterproof. And in the back, it leaked a little bit, not a ton. So I wouldn't say it's 100% waterproof. Um, they do give you a little bit of extra foam padding if you want to be able to kind of seal everything off. For me, it's not that critical. Uh, a little bit of water is fine. You know, if I have my golf clubs back here, or if you have tools back here, um, you know, I don't think that amount of water is going to be too critical, at least for me. If it is for you, this is probably isn't the one. Um, but for me, I think it was just fine. So the price on this bad boy is $486 and they go on sale quite often. I've seen it as low as like 440. So um, I think this is the best budget hard tanu cover. Um, I mean, they can range up to $1,300, I think for the OEM one. Um, so they get pretty pricey, um, but less than 500 bucks for a hard tanu cover. I mean, man, I've yet to see one um, of this quality and at that price. So that's why I think this is the best budget hard tanu cover. I think my only complaint is that it's not a, a perfect fit here with the bed line. Like I said, this was primarily made for the third gens. It will fit fourth gens. Um, but you can see there's a bigger gap here than there is in the back. Not a huge deal, but I mean, I would like a perfect uh, fitment, but like I said, it's really not that big of a deal. So that's just a little bit about the features. Let's jump into the install. It was super quick and easy. Here's a look at what was inside the box. There's not a lot of components, which makes this a super easy install. First thing you're gonna to wanna to do is to clean off the bed tie down rail. This is where you're going to put a foam strip that has an adhesive backing just to give it a better seal. The foam strip will go on top of this bed rail, but keep in mind that this might actually be a little bit different if you have a third gen Tacoma. The reason that I'm putting it here is because the rubber on the bed cover needs to rest on the foam and this was the best place to do it. Once you have the surface all clean, you can remove the backing on the foam and apply it to the top of the rail. It's the same width as the bed rail, so it had a perfect fitment. Next, you're gonna to wanna to pop off these plastic pieces from the bed rail and insert the provided bracket. You're gonna to wanna to do this to each of the four corners of the bed. This is where you will attach the bed cover to the truck. Once you have the bracket on, you can replace this plastic clip. 
Next, you're ready to put the bed cover on top and get it positioned to be able to screw it down. I made sure that I had the same amount of spacing on each side of the bed before I secured it down. Next, grab the latch and screw it onto the bracket. You're going to want to do this to the other side as well. Once you have those two front latches screwed down, you can now fully unfold the cover. In the back there are these quick release latches that are adjustable, so if you need it to be a little bit tighter or looser, all you gotta do is just remove it and then spin it a few times. And uh, you're gonna wanna do this to the other side as well. So there you have it guys, this install was super easy and I like it because now I can lock the tailgate and it keeps everything in the bed secure. Alright everyone, thanks for watching. Hopefully that video was informational for you. Please be sure to like and subscribe and uh, we'll catch you in the next video.